All of the true crime documentaries have told me never meet a man alone in the woods, especially if he has a chainsaw. Meredith, can I bug you for a second? Frank, you're a criminal. Ooh, do we confront him or not? Let's do this. Sure, Frank. What's up? That Walter Morgan guy, uh, what did he want from you? He wanted to throw you in jail. He was asking all sorts of questions. Also about you, Frank. God damn it. Can you believe that jerk? Are you in trouble, Frank? Trouble? <laughs> They're the ones who are in trouble. I gotta get back to it, Meredith. Have a great day. Oh, before Frank. I forget, that Robert Harris guy was here this morning, looking for you. He asked if you could drop by. He's working somewhere in the forest. Today. Is that our lumberjack boyfriend? Robert is sus. Robert is Good real work, sus. Theo. Theo, positive or that P? Will it be a P or a double P? Walter Morgan has the answer. Uh. Every now and then, I spend some time in Providence Oaks, and I'm always happy to see this beautiful and orderly village and its well-mannered inhabitants. Did someone just call me well-mannered? <laughs> I'll take it. Let's see if the weather will behave today. Where are we? Heron Circle. Um. Gimme. 209. Where is that? Where are the house numbers? What does this say? 203. 205. 207. This is a cute house. 209. That is a big ass tree stump to be so close to this house. Nope. No answer. Damn. I love the morning burbs. We have so many things to deliver today. Ooh, this turning radius though. Let's go besties. Oh, oh man. You mean I can't run over that? I feel like that would have just knocked over. Um, are we going to the flick thing? Flick shack. We're on Main Street. I guess this is it. Oh, that's heavier than I thought. <gasps> what she got, what she got. What if she ordered something for me? Look at those bell bottoms. Hey, Hi. So I'm guessing oh, that hug must have way too long. Huh? <laughs> We've got a great selection. Oh, really? Got anything romantic? <laughs> sure do. Or, wait, you do mean movies, right? So, what's on your mind, babe? Oh, why? I don't want to do this right now. Ugh. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what to make of what happened the other day. Of us, so to speak. I mean, we went out. We had fun. We kissed. What do you need, a road map? <laughs> well, when you put it that way... Just spit Hi, it Andy, out, gal. In. Tell me what you're thinking. I promise I can take it. I'm thinking that I don't want to ruin my chances with the lumberjack, and I don't know if it's automatically going to do that if I'm already dating you. Ugh. They're making me commit. I want to date the lumberjack, too. I do have an Apple Watch. Victoria! Hi, Victoria. We were just talking about you. 
Don't be afraid of commitment. The thing is, I don't want to lose my chance with the lumberjack either. Victoria, um, do you know about how long it took you to get through Lake? If you had to guess, someone was in here asking about the playtime. Let's just I think commit. I'm starting to like you a lot. And I'd like to ask you to be a little less awesome. It's distracting me. <laughs> no can do, Miss Weiss. Being awesome is my thing. Would you ask Rocky to stop boxing? <laughs> Touche. So anyway, what's on your mind? So, because I probably put like four or five hours into it, so maybe about ten hours. Seems I caught you in a rare moment of quiet contemplation. <sighs> yeah, uh, I just... You ever get the feeling you're not where you need to be? Oh, okay. We'll probably finish it tonight, then. You feel that way about Providence Oaks? It's just that this whole Flick Shack adventure, I think it was the right idea at the wrong time. And in the wrong place? I think so, yeah. I think I'm just too different for this town. Plus, business hasn't really been booming. Uh, and here I was hoping our movie box project would turn things around. Angie, I don't know why it wouldn't, <laughs> but I'm not sure. It almost did. Don't think that it didn't help. That's what I mean with the wrong time. I'm sure video will be huge. But it isn't. Not yet. Not here, anyway. So you're leaving? Yeah. Yes, I am. Wow. I, I didn't realize until just now that I'd already made my mind up, but I guess I have. There's a pretty and pink leaving. spoof back here. Gosh, it feels so liberating to say. Oh, there it is. Pretty and lilac. You know? Have you made your mind up yet? Uh, about your future, I mean? I want to go meet the lumberjack this afternoon. Me? No, not yet. Thank you, Maddie. Well, take your time. I want to give it my full attention when you do decide. And right now, I really have to start organizing the grand closing of the Flick Shack. <laughs> we hardly knew ye. I hear ya. I'll swing by later. Why wouldn't you just sell it to someone else? These hugs are so awkward. Why wouldn't we just sell it? Rather than close it. What are you going to do with all those movies, Angie? They're so long. I hate it. Um. Yes, Joff. I am sponsored by Apple. Hi, Bex. How are you? Oh, excuse me. Angie must be loaded to just open and close businesses like that, right? Um, where's my map here? Eek. This one, cute little house. Millie x Tim, Co Tim Cook, the collab we all saw coming. What kind of sushi did you get? What on earth did these folks order? <laughs> Maddie, I'm good either way. You're not gonna hurt my feelings if you beat me, I promise. I promise. Also, sometimes I feel bad asking. <laughs> All right, I'll leave it on the doorstep. All right, on to the next one. Okay. Spicy shrimp roll, yum.
Okay, today's the day that we're talking to Robert. I thought that that was supposed to be yesterday. We have not finished it yet, no. We might finish it tonight though. Actually, I might just commit to finishing it tonight. Because it seems like if we don't, we're going to be basically at the ending and I don't want to leave it with just a little bit left. I think that there's also like... I read somewhere that it tells you... Where the fuck is my cursor? It tells you how long the game is. It's like a specific amount of days in the game. So we should be able to tell exactly how far into the game we are. I just don't know how or where to do that. I like this song. Ooh. Why are you guys stopped? What's the word? Witchcraft, that's what it was. I thought it was whiplash. Okay, now we're on Jackson Street. You hate the ending. Doesn't the ending depend on what you do though? Uh, Jackson Street. That's lighter than I thought. Stop being nosy. Where are we going? 303? I don't remember where this one goes. I don't think it's here though, is it? No, it looks like it's the next house over. Okay. Witchcraft. Can I walk in their backyard? What if I deliver it to their back door? Hello? Oh, I can't. I'm okay with the ending. I got one thing wasn't resolved, so I've head canoned it to be true. I wonder if you guys got similar endings. Why does Meredith do the military stuff? My dad used to be a drill sergeant, so he taught me how to do the drill All sergeant right, walk. I'll leave it on the doorstep. Yeah, please don't. You and Victoria can DM each other though. Or you can talk about it in the server. Just do the spoiler thing. And then I'll just look at it after I finish the game. <clears throat> we are flying. What is... There's like... S oh, it's a weird shadow. Familiar. <clears throat> My dad wanted me to join the Coast Guard. And I said... Knowing me, World War III would break out and they would put a gun in my hands and send me to war and I would just poop my pants. So that wouldn't work. <clears throat> yeah, Bex, that works. I glitched that semi-truck and now it's not moving and it's holding up all of downtown. <clears throat> Whoopsie! Oh! Absolutely not joining the military. We did a tour of a basic training camp recently and it made me wish that I would have at least just done basic training when I was young and fit. Just cause it seems like a really good like accomplishment, but then I wouldn't do well with the whole being in the army thing after that. It hops that car hopped, right? They're glitching. They look funny. It's gotta be like a mess up with the shadow rendering or something. <clears throat> I think it is. When I use my witchcraft. Oh, look at that parking job. Just kiss the curb. Gently kiss the curb. Just like I kissed Angie. Let's double check that we're done in this corner. Yeah, we just have one more on the way out. Okay. Okay. Excuse me. I wonder if I can kind of tell which side of the road it's on. Is it this mailbox right here? I feel like it is.
Okay. Now I think we can head out around the lake. Okay, yeah, and it's gonna show us where Robert is, which is nice. Because I tend to get lost in the woods. None in this neighborhood. This is the uh, old lady with a bunch of cats. Wait. Oh no, it's down here. This is the cat house. If you guys want a little tour. Little cat tour. This is the cat house. Can I interact with them? They're so cute. I wish I could interact with them. Oh my god, there's one up here. Hi! That one looks like There's one on the roof! <gasps> They're literally everywhere, yeah. And the little old lady that lives here is a bitch. Excuse me, sorry. Okay, so we need to turn off right after the river. Oh, nope, a little bit further. <laughs> a little bit further, okay. And he's somewhere back in here, I think. It would seem. Ah. 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 What if your truck could take damage? Ow. Oh, he be logging. He do be logging. Your truck would be out of commission. There's literally a clip of me being like, oh, I'm getting so much better at driving. And then me literally flipping the car upside down on this road. This is... All of the true crime documentaries have told me never meet a man alone in the woods, especially if he has a chainsaw. I don't like this. Where is he? Where is he? I'm scared. This is so scary. What the hell? He's this direction. Shay, I love that for you. Oh my god, he's up there. Hey, Meredith. I'm up here. Hey, Robert. Wow, that's really high. What? I can't hear you. <laughs> should I come up as well? Sorry, I can't hear you. Maybe I should come down first. Damn. I wanted to climb. Can you hear me now? Hi, Meredith. Let's be nerdy. Loud and clear. Over. Thanks for coming She's out here. Looking. This arborist job came up suddenly. Awesome. I'd love to try that sometime. It's great up there. I used to climb a lot. Still do, actually. But now I get paid for it, too. Anyways, I figured it would also be good for you to see where the apartments are planned. No, oh, okay. So <laughs> What now? Well, I want you to listen to my wild card plan. Tell me all about it. I've scheduled a recording session at a professional sound studio. Get 
get out of here. Are we gonna do a tree version of We Are the World? Yes, I can do Bruce. We are the world. We are the children. That sounds great. I'll be... <laughs> oh. Oh. Cindy Lauper. Well, 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 let us realize All that a change can only come Oh, yes. But no. Sorry. <laughs> There'll be a radio message to get the people of Providence Oaks involved. Ma'am. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, probably better that way. <laughs> yeah, leave the singing to the pros. It'll be this afternoon, by the way, at Jack Reynolds' barn. Are you in? I could use an extra mm. set of ears. Are we going to make out a Jack Reynolds' barn? Studio, huh? Okay, I'm in. I don't have Great. other planes, do Maybe I? Maybe they're after work. I'm going to get back up in this tree now. See you later. This is Shade... Cashmere, cashmere sweater. Use code Melly for no money off. You pay full price. Gorgeous, gorgeous girls are gay male ladies. Megan, I got your letter today, speaking of. Bye. Be careful up there. Thanks. We are the ones to make a brighter day. So let's start giving. That was interesting. Use code Millie for th use code Millie and Venmo to send me three dollars if you buy it. It's a um, apple spice winter warmer. It's a hard seltzer aged on oak chips. It's made to taste like a whiskey cocktail. It's delicious. <gasps> Megan, I love that for you. Tell us all about it. What was on the menu? What did we have? Wait, can I go talk to him again? Where is he? I hate how sometimes you can talk to them more than once and I just like walk off and leave. Was it this tree that he's in? I can't even see him. Maybe not. Hello? There he is. Um, yum. Uh, Kodak Cakes makes a really good protein pancake mix. You can add like milk and egg to and it's like a shit ton of protein and they actually taste so good. If you are ever having pancake guilt, which you shouldn't, but they're yummy. Okay, oh, we need to go to the watchtower. Oh, no, we don't. It just was orange because I was clicking on it. Are we done? No. Lake Road and Raven Way. Oh, over here. And... Where's the other one I'm missing? I'm, blink I'm being blind. Help. Where am I missing one? What's the difference, Megan? Ooh, yeah. Where am I missing one? I guess it'll show me on the map. Deer Crossing. Villager hunting for Eric from a mail truck. Oh my god. Can I go get like my truck stuck somewhere? Is that an option? Um, where is this one to the left of us? It must be under. Wait, there's one there, and then it says that there's one this way. Is it like under and... Oh my god, this is embarrassing. Why don't I see it? Oh, it's down here. Okay. 
You just have to be in Florida, sorry. Breakfast is my favorite meal. I have this weird thing where like, no matter what time I wake up, my first meal has to be breakfast or I just feel lopsided. So even if I wake up at like 2 p.m. and it's like lunchtime, I have to have breakfast first still. It drives people crazy, especially on like brunch days if it's like past noon. I'm like, no, we still need breakfast. I don't understand. I can't just like wake up and eat a sandwich. I have to have breakfast. Yeah, I can't go without breakfast because my I'm hypoglycemic, so my blood sugar says, and then I get all shaky. Well, cake is different. Yeah, I love cake. Same, Dorcasaurus. I can't buy cereal anymore because I was just eating cereal for every single meal three times a day and that's not good for ya Megan same that's not wrong that's just inventive I love leftover cake for breakfast um, oh no we've never been back here I don't think Oh, we should have come from the other way. This turn's gonna be hard. Oh. Hello? What? Uh. Okay. I want you to flip this truck so bad. Whenever I buy cereal, I have to keep three different kinds in the house. I have to keep a wonder what this is. I have to keep a fruity, a chocolatey, and like a neutral. Like a, like a Honey Nut Cheerios or a Pops or something like that. Do a barrel roll in the government vehicle. That's what I thought I was gonna get in trouble for the first time. Please answer. Nope, no answer. No. Are you kidding me? Who lives here? What is happening? Hey, pick it back up. Hey, go inside. What is going on here? What the hell? Okay. Right? The door's not just falling off the hinges. Literally, this isn't like accessory to murder or anything. That was the wrong way to turn. We got this. Oh no. <laughs> Literally. Ah! Is this the road? This isn't the road. Where's the road? I went the wrong way. Loop it around, loop it around. Oh no. Oh no. Where's the road? Uh huh. Another scary house. Where's the road? Is this the road? Get me out of here. <laughs> we? I'm doing nothing. Is there no one else playing Lake on Twitch right now? Thank you for the host, Megan. I appreciate that. Ah. Uh. 
Oh, thank God, pavement. Get me out of here. <laughs> Joff, that's an exaggeration. I'm very good at my job. I'm very nosy and look at packages and pry into people's lives. Just like any male person should. Where did we... Where is this last package? Just in the late, like... Oh, 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 there are nine people playing and other people just like in the wrong category. What are they playing? Are they swimming in lakes? Maddie, why are you sore? Eh, like, did they attack you? One's literally playing DVD. That's how it was yesterday when I was looking for Animal Crossing streamers and everyone was playing New Horizons. I was like, besties, this is not the right category. In French? What's in French? We get to see our bestie. Wait. Where's the package? Oh, thank you. <laughs> Thanks, Meredith. Oh no, Megan. <laughs> Look at how pretty it is. There's a mountain up there. Okay. Whatever you say. What do we have? The guy playing DVD is French. They were just real naughty day having accidents falling off the table. Hi, Kay. Package for you. Oh my god, Maddie. Uh. I thought I might as well give it to you now instead of, you know, waiting till you're home. Oh, thanks. That's super amazing. Thank you. What the fuck? Um, what is it? Oh my god. What is <laughs> so it? I'm so excited about this. <laughs> I see. This is a guessing game. All right. Is it a... A box of bunnies? No, but that would totally make the kids' day, though. Berries a lot less. Probably. Okay. If it's illegal. The suspense is killing me. Open it! Okay, you ready? It's actually a Yamaha DX7 synthesizer! Oh man, I am super stoked this arrived so soon! I got this amazing deal on it through the classified. This old guy was selling it. Apparently he had never really used it. I mean, what? How? Can you imagine owning something like this and not using it every moment you get? I mean, this synth is used everywhere these days, so I was like, yes, this is mine! <laughs> Sorry, I can get carried away about this kind of stuff. I know, you're doing that speeding up thing again. To be honest, you lost me around the time you opened the box. But if it works like a computer, sign me up. Computers, eh? Oh, wait, are you a programmer? Because if you are, you should totally check out the Insonic Mirage. <laughs> Stop, you're doing it again. Oh, man, you're right. Listen, Em, I totally owe you for lugging this around for me. Now, what will you have? It's on the house. I hope you feel better soon, Maddie. Pie. I mean, I'd love some blueberry pie if you have it. Oh, I just sold the last slice. We're clean out. Kay's Anything married else? with two kids. I owe you? I owe you it is. Apparently, I have some baking to get started on now. But good to see you. And thanks again. No problem. Have fun with your synthesizer. When am yes, I going to get thanks. my pie? I've asked for pie so many times. We can be step mommy, true. Kay is one of the hats. I know, me too. 
I was too. I really thought that something was going to happen the first time we met her. We're like childhood best friends. To fill you in. The hats. Let's go this way. Right, Dorcasaurus. I agree. What if I had a girlfriend, a boyfriend, and a wife? Shay, let's go on Switch or on computer? Because it's impossible on Switch. I'm going to park the car to initiate our evening cutscene. And I'm going to go grab another drink from the fridge. Will you guys behave for two seconds? Be nice. Don't make a mess. Okay, folks. It's showtime. Robert, are you ready? Yes, but before we start, I'm not a pro, so please bear with me. This better be worth it. You'll do great. Okay, Robert. Take it away. <clears throat> Fellow Providence Okians. Right. I'm Robert Harris, and I oppose the plans for new apartments on Lakeview Drive. If you feel the same, let Town Hall know about it and give them a call. Let's keep Providence Oaks pretty. Perfect. That's a wrap, folks. Back to work. Hold on. Hold on, Jack. Meredith. What do you think? The text is fine, but I miss a revolutionary vibe. It needs more passion. Um, uh, okay, you might be right. Jack, one more recording, please. Sure, Robert. Here we go in one, two, three, action. Fellow Providence Okians, I'm Robert Harris, and I oppose the plans for new apartments on Lakeview Drive. If you feel the same, let Town Hall know about it and give them a call. Let's keep Providence Oaks pretty. Better? Oh my god, Dorkasaurus! Thank you so much for subscribing at Tier 1, Bran. Welcome in. Enjoy your emotes and your ad free viewing and your sub badge. I was also literally just about to say that just like an Entitled Goose game, if you guys have ever played, you can type Y in the chat to honk. I should make that a command. I'm going to do that really quick. That's what those random honks are that you guys are hearing. Now we have that. And then Nightbot replies with a honk. Yay! Enjoy the emotes. We just got animated emotes, I think, yesterday, and I'm working on a few more. Well, Bex is actually working on a few more for me. But yeah, thank you so much. I appreciate that, Bran. Welcome to the fam. Um... Could you also try my other suggestions? Actually, no. Could you also try Attention Providence Oaks and Lake Lovers, listen up. So just the first words. Yeah, Robert, if you could hurry up a bit. <laughs> Potatoes don't come out of the ground voluntarily. One, two, three, action. <clears throat> Attention, Providence Oaks. Lake Lovers, listen up. Like that? A star is born. Now, let's do some real work. Cute. Oh, do I say no, wait, it's not quite there yet? No, wait, it's not quite there yet. We well, believe in the mission. Who. Robert, you said this would only take a minute. You're right, Jack. Sorry, Meredith. This will have to do. Okay, fine. It's your precious lake. 
No problem. This should be good enough. All right. It's time to really roll up our sleeves. You ready, Robert? Sure thing, Jack. Meredith, I'm gonna return the favor and help Jack out today. If you lovebirds want to spend more time together, she can come along too. <gasps> Plenty of work to do. Jack, what the? We better get going. Good luck with those taters. Nothing wrong with a bit of hard work outdoors. Let's go. Sure, but I'll leave the Ludberg squabbling over to you. Nothing wrong with a bit of hard work outdoors. Let's go. Rock on. Let's do this. Okay, folks. Hop on my tractor. It's time for the real show. Let's fucking go, farmers. Oh, a loading screen. Ooh. Exactly. Oh, did we not get to see it again? Meredith, it's me. Oh, hi, Steve. I'm sorry. Didn't get the chance to look at the contracts yet. Oh, you didn't? I'm just very Fuck busy. you, Steve. Sorry. All right. Hey, uh, I gotta run. Corporate lawyer appointment. Bye. Fuck you, Steve. Ooh. Watch TV, read a book, or review the contracts. Or let's review the contracts. All right. Here we go again. 